to Astro now and here's a binary star system. OK, so the stars are rotating this way and Earth is over here. So when star A gets to Q, it's coming towards us. And so the light from it will be blue shifted. It will have a shorter wavelength than if the star was stationary there. And when it's at P, it's moving away from us. And so it will be red light from it will be red shifted. Its wavelengths will be longer than if the star was stationary relative to us. And finally, sneakily, when the star is at R, it's moving per at that instant, it's moving perpendicular to us. So actually, it's not getting further away or closer. So at that point, there's no shift at all. The light there is exactly the same as it would be if the star was just stationary, completely stationary. OK, and so putting that onto the diagram, there we go. So at Q, the wavelengths have got shorter and at P they've got longer and then you write that in words as well and you say that because the star it's because the star is coming towards us at Q and so the light is red shifted and moving away from us at P and so the light is blue shifted sorry other way around moving towards us at Q so the light is blue shifted and moving away from us at P so the light is red shifted <laughs>